For decades now, the Zaka Group has been a leader in the development of standardized systems for power, steam, and heat generation, all the way to special systems and customized turnkey solutions. The company with a long tradition combines classic burner production with boiler manufacturing and thus achieves optimum coordination of all components from a single source. At the same time, Zaka sets new standards regarding energy efficiency and stands for low pollutant combustion in industry and applications on land and water. In FPSO units, the heat supply serves to heat the process plant by means of hot water, steam or thermal oil. In addition, Zucker's systems also provide superheated steam for turbine drive. This on-deck unit consists of three water tube boilers. More about this later. First, Let's take a look at the enclosed installations. On the basis of its full-scale competence, Zucker designs new enclosed installations and also performs modernization work on existing firing systems. Using a 12-meter high water tube boiler as an example, we will now describe Zucker's services and procedures in the field of FPSO conversion. This work comprises dismantling old firing technology, air preheaters and control systems, new piping for boiler, installing economizer, installing two fuel supply units on deck, new process control system, Commissioning with oil and gas. Like the new piping shown here for a main propulsion boiler with a boiler capacity of 75 tons of steam per hour. Non destructive testing enables material testing from the outside and thus saves time and money since unnecessary work steps such as cutting open components are eliminated. In a non-destructive inspection, as here in the case of a steam header, the existing elements are checked for their further usability and descaled. In cooperation with the classification societies and future operators, the components that will no longer be used are removed while the remaining ones are refurbished and checked again. Zucker makes use of all commonly applied methods, from structural analysis and ultrasonic testing all the way to magnetic particle tests. The aim of the structural analysis shown here is to get an idea of the metal structure and particle sizes. For this purpose, the surface is first exposed, polished and etched. Using a foil, an impression is then made and examined under the microscope. In addition, it is possible to identify welding defects by means of an ultrasonic test. The surface is again exposed and polished and then a contact agent with a similar density as the metal to be checked is applied. Now the inspection is carried out using an ultrasonic sensor. All measuring points are marked and documented. In a magnetic particle test, any cracks in the component surface are identified. The area to be checked is cleaned and sprayed with a magnetic testing agent. When a magnetic field is applied, the testing agent is concentrated precisely at the cracks. A pool of 70 trained craftsmen and engineers are available on site for assignment to any of these tasks at all times. Top-level construction supervision takes place from Europe in close coordination with the team on site.
Zaka utilizes state-of-the-art production techniques for maintenance as well as for building new facilities and achieves a level of quality that is better than the original. A good example of this is bending. The pipes to be replaced are dismantled and new ones are made piece by piece. To guarantee easy installation, the pipes to be replaced are delivered directly to the boiler production site and used as models for production. Zucker's workshops have raw materials of every grade. The bending machines operate according to up-to-date standards and can even produce superheater pipes with a bending radius of radius over diameter equal to 1. On the left, you can see the old pipe. On the right, the pipe made by Zaka. It displays a consistent wall thickness. The circular pipe cross-section is retained. Our systems are, of course, also designed for 3D bending. Zaka is also able to produce components with a large material diameter or wall thickness via hot bending. By heating the pipe to approximately 700 to 800 degrees Celsius during the bending operation and at the same time tempering it using cooling water. After all, the hot bending process depends on an optimum temperature. Excessive heat destroys the crystal structure of the component. It would become coarser in grain, and overall the material would lose strength. After that, the pipe is cut to the desired length and is ready for assembly. Zaka produces at several international locations, so as to be close to the customer at all times. The workshops have state-of-the-art machinery and equipment, as well as 200 highly qualified employees, from production planners to special welders. To make installation, such as of the membrane wall shown here, as effective as possible, the boiler is completely assembled in the assembly shop thus ensuring the optimum geometry of all components. By means of the heat treatment method, the stress built up during machining can be entirely removed from the workpiece. The Zaka production plant in Qingdao, China, measures 14,000 square meters and is equipped with a crane having a capacity of up to 100 tons, as well as a usable installation height of 17 meters.
Here you see our production site in Zagreb, Croatia. The boiler production plant there has a workshop measuring 8,000 square meters with an installation height of 12 meters. Both workshops operate in accordance with all established classification societies and ASME. Moreover, they have logistical location advantages. For example, it is only 10 minutes by car from the Chinese production plant to Qingdao port. There are no size limitations for the transport of workpieces. Here you now see tube installation. The workpieces are already properly pre-assembled in the production department, thus ensuring smooth installation on site. Various methods are applied in this field. Qualified and certified fitters take care of weld preparation. For tube installation too, correct heat treatment and appropriate local stress relieving annealing are elementary to ensure flawless quality of the tubes. In the next step, the pipe edge is milled and polished. The component is expanded for a precise fit by means of an expander. Finally, the staff check once again the geometry and fitting accuracy of the assembled individual parts. This ensures that right from the beginning, the pre-production of the modules is so exact that hardly any corrections are necessary during installation. On-site installation is then also carried out by Zaka's experienced and skilled workforce. To be able to transform the saturated steam from the steam drum into superheated steam for turbine drive, it is heated again to 515 degrees Celsius by means of a superheater. During this process, the steam is under a pressure of up to 63 bar. It is necessary to proceed carefully, especially with the spin ports. Special welders are trained by Zaka for this purpose. Since the material is subjected to considerable temperature fluctuations, a thorough inspection by trained personnel is standard procedure at Zaka. This is followed by exact implementation of the superheater elements in the boiler room. Zaka supplies high-quality boilers and burners from a single source. That means all components match one another perfectly and are adapted to the flame shape. The range of products extends from inexpensive basic solutions to multi-fuel burners with several fuel lances for complex requirements, variants with explosion protection, or air preheating up to 300 degrees Celsius. The innovative DDZG steam pressure atomizer, for instance, sets emission standards and has a capacity range from 10 to 80 megawatts. However, its biggest advantage is the flexible burner concept that permits simultaneous mixed firing of several gases also in combination with liquid fuels, such as crude or heavy fuel oil. 
Sensors indicate malfunctions immediately and provide for automatic changeover from one fuel to another. The DDZG burner with its low NOx flame and minimal maintenance requirements is optimally suited for use in FPSO applications and LNG carriers. Aside from enclosed installations, Zucker's portfolio for FPSO and LNG vessels naturally includes construction of new piping for on-deck units. All piping construction processes take place at the Chinese production plant. For example, two on-deck units were produced in Qindao. On the left, you see the deck gas unit. There, liquid drops and particles are separated from the gas flows. On the right, the heater unit in which the relatively viscous oil is heated to maintain the necessary oil viscosity for combustion. All work steps are coordinated from Europe and carried out according to state-of-the-art project management methods. Pre-production according to standards provides for a precise fit and uncomplicated installation on site within the shortest possible time. Zaka also optionally supports its customers in the design, procurement and installation of high-quality stainless steel fittings, air and flue gas ducts, as well as steam valves. Thus, the worldwide technology leader for firing systems additionally offers turnkey solutions for individual needs. Zucker Marine Systems is able to produce the entire on-deck unit or supply selected individual components. The picture shows three 35 megawatt hot water boilers produced by Zucker for energy and heat supply for the Dahlia refinery facility. The FPSO platform off the coast of West Africa numbers among the largest floating crude oil production systems in the world. Zaka supplied the boiler along with the firing system and control technology. The combustion plant consists of the following components and is completely produced, delivered, installed and put into operation by Zaka. Boiler Burner Fuel gas train. Fuel oil train. Combustion air fan. Exhaust gas stack.
The annual capacity of the on-deck boiler would suffice to supply heat for a small town of 30,000 houses. During peak periods, as many as 140 Zaka specialists were involved in design and production. Due to the demanding offshore conditions, they had to take into account special requirements in terms of material and stability. Because no two firing systems are alike, Zaka offers both flexible standard solutions and individual tailored systems for on-deck and under-deck units in the field of control technology. The product range extends from simple automatic firing systems to the Sevis modular control system with up to eight channels in eight operating modes, all the way to PLC-aided multi-burner control systems. User friendliness always has top priority. That means easy and reliable integration into existing process control systems, as well as clearly organized menu navigation and graphical user interface. Over 80 years of experience and know-how, put your trust in the world market leader for onshore and offshore firing technology. Put your trust in Zaka.